The overall goal of this in vitro method is to generate the three-dimensional cell culture spheroids that enable the testing of current standard or experimental therapy regimens for head and neck squamous cell carcinoma. This method helps us to understand three-dimensional tumor growth of head and neck cancer cells when exposed to radiation or chemoradiation treatment. It remains to be said that handling primary tumor cells is difficult and does not always lead to reliable three-dimensional spheroid formation. Demonstrating the procedure will be Sabina schwenk a technician from our laboratory. While using primary cells from a tumor specimen, place the specimen on a suitable and sterile surface and cut it thoroughly with a sterile, single-use scalpel into very small pieces. After sufficient mechanical separation of the primary tissue, transfer it into a vial containing collagenase 1 and 2 and incubate it for one hour at 37 degrees Celsius. Next, sieve the mixture through a 70 micrometer Falcon cell strainer and wash the suspension with HBSS. After successful separation and subsequent washing, transfer the suspension containing 1 to 2 million cells into a T75 cell culture flask to grow to subconfluency at 37 degrees Celsius for up to 10 days. Under a microscope, confirm tumor cell growth. Count the cells in culture. Using an ultra-low adhesion 96-well plate with concave round bottoms, seed 5,000 primary tumor cells, or 1,000 to 2,000 cells.